Hello everyone, this is a brief tutorial to help you to create your very first podcast. And to do that we're going to use Audacity and the web service Podbean. So to do this tutorial you'll have already had to create a, an account in Podbean. We won't cover that. So once you've created that then we'll start here. First of all if you look down here on the uh, on a Mac you'll see down here at the bottom all the different programs. Audacity is the little one that's got the kind of flaming audio lines between the headphones. If you double click on that up will pop Audacity and you'll see here it is right here and it looks pretty basic and what I'm going to do is open up and start a, uh, a brand new recording. A couple of things you might want to do first though. You might want to double check down here on the uh, the menu bar down here on the bottom there's system preferences. If you click on that and go to sound you can check and see now I'm using this headphone set so for output and input it looks there it is and we can see I've got some audio coming in so you can see the meters and that's the one I'm using. Now if you do this down in the edit bays, which you probably will, then we use uh, what's called an AJA box and so we'll go through with that and you can see what setting it needs to be on there. You shouldn't need to change too much. You should be able to just open it up. It should be preset. But just in case, uh, that's one thing you can check. Check your uh, system preferences. Again, that's down here on the bottom menu bar, system preferences. Okay, the next thing under Audacity, you can click on Audacity up here on the upper left and go into preferences and uh, we're worried about the audio in and out. No, we're not going to worry about the quality for right now. It's usually got a preset that's just fine. But you can see the device again is this headset that I'm using and uh, for recording it's the same thing. Now you can set it to stereo or mono but for the most part when you're recording into it then mono is just fine. Um, you can set it on stereo if you want. And you can see what these other settings are but they're not really too particular or relevant right now. So that's okay. So the, right now you don't see any meters or anything going on. I'm talking and it's not recording. To record all you have to do in Audacity is press the red record button. Once you do, here it goes and you see some meters right up here and you'll see the waveform moving along as I talk about this. And so what I'm going to do is going to talk for just a minute or two. You'll have pre-scripted your 60 second podcast but I'm only going to talk for a few more minutes. And I'm going to go ahead and click the stop button. And when I click the stock button, all I have to do to hear it back is push the play bar. Now when you're in the edit bays, you'll have to adjust the uh, mixer board. And there's some pots that you'll slide up and down so you can hear the audio in there. And we'll go over that in class. And there's also a lab assistant that can help you out if you get confused. So let me hit the space bar. And here I can hear you this. You can't, of course, right because it's coming over my headphones. But you see that it's right. playing back. Okay. Now a couple of tools I want to show you in Audacity. Um, you can read straight through your 60 second uh, podcast and do it just uh, live but sometimes you might make a mistake and that's one of the things we don't want to have because we're all uh, doing digital recording so there's no reason to have a mistake. So say I make a mistake somewhere and that's perfectly fine. Uh, all I have to do is go back in if I know the mistake happens to be this section right here then I highlight it and I'm using this tool right here you see up in the upper left just a marker tool. I highlight it if I hit the delete button then that part's gone and I can go do an edit and undo delete and it'll show back up. Uh, but say uh, you were talking long and you didn't like the last story or the last thing that you did. So you can go ahead and click record again. Uh, before you do that I would definitely hit this mute button so you're not hearing uh, this recording as you're recording a new one. So here we go. I'm going to hit record again and voila there you go I'm recording again. Now it started right where the playhead was but I can move that around. I'm going to show you how to do that. So here I am recording again. I'm going to hit the stop button. Okay, now here I am. I have all this space before I started speaking. I really don't want that. So let's highlight that and see if we can't just get rid of that. In fact, here's what we're going to do. See this little tool up here? It's a little move tool. And if I click on that and go over here, I can slide this audio up and down wherever I want. So what I want to do now is say I recorded some and I want to add this onto the very end. I'll slide it down and I'll match it up with my previous recording in the track above it. And I'll unmute that and then I can play those. Click back on my, my cursor tool, click that and I can play it. Now I get it through my headphones so you Stop won't hear that. Again. And so I can match things up. Okay, and I'll show you this in class, but this is a demo that you can use uh, in case you get stuck and you're trying to figure out what to do. Okay, so you're all done. Everything looks great just the way you want it to be uh, under Audacity and you go to File and export as mp3 and it has to be an mp3 or it won't play in Podbean. So export as mp3 and it says that your tracks will be mixed down to a single mono channel and that's fine. Click OK and I tell it where I want it to save it and I'm just going to put this on my desktop for right now and I'm going to call this uh, Podbean 
test and it saves it as an mp3 file so we'll go ahead and save that and it's going to give me uh, some things I can title it so pod bean test and the artist is brother Howard you don't have to put any of this information if you don't want but I'm gonna ahead and go ahead and do that and genre is not blues but uh, how about industrial it doesn't give me a good genre and that's okay click OK and here it goes it'll take just a few seconds because this is a really short file and now I'm gonna go ahead and minimize this and on my desktop you'll see here it is podbean 3 I'm gonna go ahead and open that with uh, QuickTime player it should open right up and there it is and it will play back here we and go. again see some meters right up here I'm here doing on my headphones moving along as I okay talk about looks good so there's on my desktop now our next step let's go ahead I've already opened up my Podbean account and I'm gonna go back to uh, in fact let me go right back to Podbean when you first log in there's my actual site and let's go back to Podbean here's what it looks like when you get there and go ahead and log in I've already logged in but you go ahead and click on login which is up here and log in with your username password and then it will show up with your username right up here and mine is mass media talk I'm going to go ahead and click on that and it'll bring up this menu right here okay and I'm looking at what I've got it looks great and I see this uh, bar up here menu bar that says add a podcast it's a tab so I'm going to go ahead and do that now you can explore this all you want for this assignment I just want you to add a podcast but you can go ahead and change the look of your website and do all kinds of things that you want to do okay and uh, oh sorry I want to publish a podcast not add a podcast publish a podcast well once you get there all you have to do is go to publish a new show you click on that it's gonna ask you for a couple of things one it's gonna ask you for a title and it's gonna ask you for a tag so mine is all about mass media so that's if someone's searching for it these are uh, keywords tags that they can search for and I'm gonna put this as a pod bean test now you can add text here if you want I'm gonna just say this is a pod bean test you can say whatever you want for this particular assignment and now I'm gonna go down here and it's going to say what type of file mp3 I'm gonna browse for it right here on my desktop and I've got a lot of stuff on my desktop so let's see if I can find that pod bean pod bean where are you there we go podbean test mp3 open that up and uh, then I'm gonna go ahead and publish it this one's very short it will only take a few seconds once it's done there it is now I'm gonna click on the view site and as you look at my site that's created that's the very first thing that's going to show up is the podbean test I click the play button and it there will start goes. to play it's, it's going to sound kind of ridiculous because I just do, was I mumbling around about this. all right so what that's how it's done so this hopefully this little podcast will help you podcast. as you're putting this together putting this on podbean and using audacity and more we'll review it again in class so if you have any more questions all right that'll do it hopefully this helped you out